Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. We we got him? What what did we get? Did we get the guy you told to say this pushed into a locker and his left arm chopped off by the door shutting on him? If I was a middle school bully, and, and trust me, uh, getting made fun of for being left-handed is probably the most middle school shit I've ever heard in my life. So if I was a middle school bully and someone said that to me as a comeback, I'd, I'd honestly feel kind of bad for him. I'd feel just the slightest shred of empathy for this kid as I slam his head into the brick wall outside by the flagpole. Yeah, comeback TikToks are probably my favorite genre of TikTok right now. Yeah, this is this is a genre of TikTok. People make these routinely. Well, to be fair, this genre is kind of dead now, so I guess they aren't really making them routinely anymore. Probably because the format is fucking horrendous. They pretty much entirely consist of someone holding their finger out over a blank background that is devoid of anything meaningful or interesting, a shitty TikTok song playing in the background, and then them cutting to a great insult for half a second. And of course, because the actual insult, the, the thing that you came to the video for is at the end of the video for half a nanosecond. It's like, it's just a flash. It's a a, a flash on the screen and you miss it. Then you have to rewatch the video, giving them another play, and then helping them out in the algorithm to make more shitty comebacks. And it's just this self-perpetuating cycle of pain and suffering that no one benefits from, except for the mysterious finger wagging into the void. It's fantastic. I, I, I love everything about this. By the way, I, I'm compressing the length of all the TikToks I show because I don't want the $1 this video is going to make me in ad revenue to get copyright claimed. I'm currently saving up to buy a singular can of Arizona iced tea from the gas station down the street. Baby, let me see it. I just want to eat it. What the heck, dude? You're kind of like dirty minded, man. That that was a weird thing to say. <laughs> what? Fuck. What, what did that TikTok tell me to say? Shit. Fuck. What was it? Oh, you say I'm dirty minded. But then how did you understand what I meant? Oh, got him, dude. What? Boom. What? Burn. Shut the fuck up. What are you talking? You Shut just up. Got, you just got come back dude, on, bro. you literally said you were going to bend my mother over and gape her asshole wide open. The fuck are you talking about? The comments on this one are absolutely fantastic. Could, could you not do it so fast? Can you make it longer so I can actually read it? I had to watch two times because I don't know the first time. Jesus fucking Christ. So, you're so stupid. So stupid. So, so fucking dumb. Why was I listening? Because I have ears? I can't just, I can't just turn them off, you fucking moron. What are you, fucking left-handed or something? I, I think you and I both know what's coming. I... Don't, don't make this more difficult than it needs to, okay? Just... Just get in. Get in. I, that was a horrible comeback. What, 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 did you hear that one on fucking TikTok? Just, just please get in. Don't, don't make me push ya. Okay, there we go. Alright. See you in an hour. When you're at a pool party and on TikTok. Me, lol. <laughs> The, the finger guy is super relatable because, like, I also use TikTok and, like, he's using TikTok while at a social situation because he's, like, outside at, like, a pool party and I'm, like, socially awkward and he's also socially awkward. He's, like, dude, he's, like, just like me. When you're doing your math homework and on TikTok, me, lol. When you're committing a felony and on TikTok, me, Lol. When you're storming the beaches of Normandy and on TikTok. Me. Lol. When you're slowly bleeding out on the pavement after getting struck by a stray bullet during a drive-by shooting and on TikTok. Me. Lol. So the comeback TikToks we've been watching so far that consisted of hands wagging into the void um, were popular, quote-unquote, in 2020. But in 2021, to kind of also right now there's a new format that has been dominating the comeback scene took the comeback tiktok scene by storm instead of having a background that was devoid of any substance or anything interesting people just started ripping videos of other people doing tiktok dances and then layering multiple comebacks over that they didn't just stop at one. Yeah, there's multiple ones now. The, the new upgraded Comeback 2.0 TikTok format has not one, not two, not three, not four, but like five or six or seven possible comebacks in the same TikTok. It's, it's pretty crazy shit. 
I'd say there are more comebacks than there is come on your mother's back. It's incredible. This format really did revolutionize the genre. This format is fantastic because it stays true to itself. It changes just enough all the things that were wrong with the original format, but still is absolute dog shit. Great. Fantastic by me. Actually, I would argue the, the comebacks on the, this new, the new wave, the new, the avant-garde comeback TikToks are actually even worse. These are, th these are fucking horrible. These are actually worse than the other ones. You're not my mom. I don't want to be. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. That was, that was fire. Holy shit. Because the, the implication is that um, that person is so annoying and that you don't like them that you wouldn't even want to be their mom. That, like, you, you if you were their mom, you would, like, want to, like, give them up for adoption or, like, have, like, a post-birth abortion or, like, leave them in a river or, like, um, throw them off a cliff. Wow, you're so rude. Ha, yeah, says you. There is no way anyone older than the age of 10 wrote this. There's no way. I'm pretty sure... When the new genre, the new the new revolution, the, the avant-garde comebacks took over, so did the children. I think what was happening before is we had people that were like 18 or 19 years old making these shitty comeback videos just to milk TikTok views. But then a couple young TikTok entrepreneur types saw these comeback videos and were like, hey, that doesn't have enough sparkles on it. I'm going to do it better. Grow up. You can't give me advice that you haven't done yourself. Oh yeah? Really? I, I can't give you advice that I haven't personally acted on. So my friend who is a heroin addict, I can't give him advice to stop doing heroin because I've never stopped doing heroin myself because I never started doing heroin. Hey, uh, tips for my girls. I uh, just wanted you to know that when my friend overdoses and dies, uh, the blood is on your hands. You caused this. It's your fault. Now it's time to look at a subgenre of the new avant-garde comeback format called Baddie Comebacks. Supposedly, these are a list of comebacks curated by only the baddest of the baddies. I believe this one in particular was curated by um, Michelle Obama. God, I feel so fucking old watching this shit, man. That is actually the most annoying fucking sound I've ever heard in my life. It, why does it sound like a dodgeball smacking against the floor of a gymnasium? Shut the fuck up, please. How these are actually different from the normal comeback TikToks, I I have no idea. Your, your guess is as good as mine. You are so dumb. Oh well, since you know everything, you should know when to shut up. Can I please make the joke? No, dude, the joke fucking sucks, bro. Come on. No, it's, it's, a good it's, one. it's awful. Dude, it's a, it's no, a good joke. Dude, it People fucking are gonna sucks. Laugh at it it's a it good sucks. One. I promise. It fucking sucks. It's not a good joke. Wait, are we are we at the eight minute mark? Like, I, I'm, I'm just gonna say it. Dude, I'm, you're I'm a fucking say. idiot. You're losing all your street cred. Yeah, these uh these aren't baddie comebacks. These are just bad comebacks. <laughs> 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 <laughs>